Portugal. I am very happy about it. <laughs> I have been wanting to come back to Europe for the last like six years since I left pretty much. I've been to Spain and Italy and I'm finally back. Oh, so happy. Here for three weeks, one week in Lisbon where I am currently, I've been here for the last couple days, one week in the north and one week in the south. And it's been so good so far. I love Portugal. I love Europe everywhere that I've been, but I think Portugal might be my favorite country that I've ever been to overall. Might be. I just find like in Europe, the priorities of people and like society and even maybe like the government, it's just like different from the Western world of like Canada and the States. Um, and it's just nice. It just feels really good to me personally. Um, and I love it. I really like it. Just the vibe just slower pace, just, you know, different things are important here. And that makes me very happy and makes me want to stay. <laughs> um, also, persimmon season, just want to say, I have ate a minimum of four persimmons every day since I've been here. Probably going to eat them every day because they're like local here, I'm pretty sure and amazing and every corner store has like an abundance of fresh fruits and vegetables specifically persimmons and it's wonderful it makes me so happy like that's just another thing in canada like if you go to a corner store it's just like packaged garbage like there is absolutely no produce and here it's just everywhere ah, wonderful anyways um, I could go off about all the reasons why I love Portugal, but that would just take forever and yeah, I don't know if that's very interesting. Let's just say I am really enjoying it for many reasons. So yeah, Blaze too. He's sleeping right now. Um, today we're going to go out and go to a organic produce market. Get some fruits and veggies. Um, I've been eating like sweet potatoes every night for dinner. They are so delicious. I'm um, pretty sure they're local here as well. I don't even know what they're called. I just know they're different kinds of sweet potatoes that I haven't had. Um, and anyway, so I've been eating those every night for dinner. I thought I would just like change it up a little bit and we're gonna get some produce to make a Portuguese um, potato and pea stew. I'm gonna make that for dinner. I'm just like been trying to eat a lot of local produce um, and make some Portuguese recipes. So that's what we're gonna do just because I personally don't um, really eat out much. So I like to still, you know, be submerged in the culture of food while we're here and eat a lot of local produce. Um, but yeah, we have done a lot, like, it's been good weather. It's rained twice, so we've gone to um, museums and art galleries when it's raining. Other than that, we've done a lot of outdoorsy stuff, walked a lot, went to a national forest and whatnot. I feel very grateful, very lucky, very happy to be here and enjoy Portugal. Hope you're enjoying the video so far and yeah. You, I will do, I'll show you everything that I'm eating today. You would have already seen my breakfast. So I'll take you along for the day, for lunch and dinner. And yeah, I'm happy. I'm a happy gal. And it's a beautiful sunny day today, so even better. Okay, hope you're doing well. Love you guys so much. Thanks again for being here. Let's go.